Hello everybody, Johnny Place here, and it finally happened. The update finally rolled out three hours after everybody thought it was going to. That's okay. So first things first, new tank hero, Sigma, he's live. And the new feature of Roll Q. So we get Sigma right here. Um, Roll Q beta, which is going to last uh, 18 days only, so the season will end soon. Um, it's an 18-day season, which is very interesting. Um, okay. Uh, trying to think of some other things. They changed up some characters. Bridget's a lot more healer focused now. That's the only thing I can remember. Um, because they're trying to make it so each character actually fits their role well. Because now it's a forced 2-2-2 two, two, two play. Um, I don't think there was anything else really all that big. Um, okay, they changed what this looked like. Which is interesting. Maybe because now there's going to be more different things. I'm really not too sure. Um, so let's... Uh, honestly, that, that's basically it. I mean, let's go ahead and look at Sigma stuff. I didn't look at any of Sigma's items yet. Um, got some pretty cool stuff. So I'm just going to unlock all of it. <laughs> I'm just going to unlock literally all of it because I can right now. Um... I mean, I'm excited to learn how to play Sigma, and I'm also extremely excited for Q Roll Q. Uh, I think which which ones really do I really like? I like the one a lot. Okay. So, oh, and actually, I do want to look at his. Uh, eh, they're okay, I guess. And I'm actually gonna get all of this as well, because I have a lot of stuff that I can. Uh, I'm literally just gonna buy all of his stuff. Actually, I like that one more. Okay. Um, of course, I'm not going to get any other stuff yet. But, yeah. So, that's basically it. I just wanted to make this little video to uh, talk about the new update. Um, actually, you know what? I'll go ahead and... Um, right now, I'll go ahead and pull up the... Um, the... What's it called? The patch notes. So, let's pull up the patch notes right now. I'm doing that right now. Here we go. Okay. So, roll queue. We know that. And, of course, we have Sigma. Uh, next thing... As I said, endorsements. Uh, players can now endorse each other in the fall. Excuse me. In the following game modes: Mr. Hero, No Limits, Deathmatch, Total Mayhem, Low Grav, and all PVE event game modes. Okay, that's awesome. Uh, here we go. Another thing: uh, Mystery Heroes on control maps. Heroes now reset between rounds. That's cool. Uh, some new workshop stuff. I don't really care too much. Uh, hero updates. Okay, hero updates. Here we go. The general thing: the global ultimate cost is increased 12%. So ultimate cost for every single character in the game is now 12% higher than it used to be. This is very interesting and very cool. Um, here we go. Ash. The only thing changed with Ash is that they decreased her reload time from 0.3 seconds to 0.25 seconds. Uh, here we go. Bridget. Um, her passive ability Inspire uh, has boosted the healing amount. Um, and the self-healing from Inspire is now halved. The repair pack now has three charges. Um, the healing amount changed from 150 to 120, so it's a bit less now. Um, and now heals over two seconds instead of instantly. I think that'll definitely be helpful. Um, and if you throw multiple packs at the same person, the current duration will be extended by two seconds. That's actually interesting. Okay, uh, her whip shot ability, the outgoing velocity is increased from 60 to 80, and the retracting time is reduced from 0.6 seconds to 0.3. So you'll have it back much sooner, so you can start using your whip a lot quicker. Um, we got some buffs, I mean, uh, some nerfs as well. Her barrier health is reduced from 500 to 200. Her shield bash uh, stun uh, duration was reduced from 0.9 seconds to 0.25 seconds, and her rally ability ultimate cost on top of the 12% is also up another 10%. So her ultimate cost has gone up 22%. That's a lot. Next up is Diva. Uh, her call mech uh, pilot ultimate cost uh, reduced by 12%. That's great. That means she can get back in her mech faster. Um, May, uh, for Doomfist, um, his quick melee no longer pauses ammo reload, which is actually really, really useful to me personally. I play a lot of Doomfist and Deathmatch, and that is my the reason I die a lot. Uh, the Storm Arrow ammo for Hanzo has been reduced from 6 to 5. That's going to be really useful uh, just for everybody else, because that is dangerous. Um, Orisa's Protective Barrier cooldown increased from 8 to 9 seconds. Um... 
Okay, that's interesting. And Reinhardt now has a new passive ability. Hello. Steady Fest. Or, sorry, not Steady Fest. Steadfest. Reduces knockback effects by 30%. Awesome. I love that a lot. I love that a lot, a lot. That's going to be really awesome. Uh, for me, I'm a Reinhardt main, so that's really cool. I didn't even realize they were doing that. Okay, next up is Sombra. Her hack ability. Duration on enemy players reduced from 6 to 5 seconds. And her EMP activation time increased from 0.2 to 0.35 seconds. Um, for Symmetra, wow, a lot of stuff going on with Symmetra's teleporter. Uh, so it now lasts an infinite duration until destroyed. Players can destroy their teleporter with the ability to input. Okay. Cooldown now starts when the teleporter is destroyed, and maximum range is increased from 25 to 30 meters. Uh, the teleporter is, teleporter is destroyed if the entrance is more than 40 meters from the exit. Okay, it's instantly destroyed then. All right. Uh, Tracer, the pulse bomb. Damage increased from 300 to 350, making it so she can deal a lot more damage to bastions. Awesome. Wrecking Ball, his minefield ability. Increased projectile speed from 10 to 12, causing the mines to spread out more. Good. Uh, reduced the activation time from 0.25 seconds to 0.1 seconds. Okay, cool. That's that's uh, that's cool. Um, and then a bunch of general bug fixes. Uh, I mean, that's that's it. I mean, uh, it's just a bunch of bug fixes after that. Um, so, yeah, I mean. I hope you guys are really excited for this whole patch. I know I sure am. Um, you know, just check it out. Look at all the new stuff. And uh, I'll see you guys all in the next video, which will probably be a roll queue video. So I'll see you guys then. Bye-bye, peeps.